friends, it's Allison. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing 10 really simple, a couple of them are a little more complex ways to make your home more cozy and huga. So if you're like, what the heck did she just say? Huga is a Danish word and it's basically another way to say cozy, but it's so much more than that. I actually have this, the little book of Huga. Danish Secrets to Happy Living book that my mom got me for Christmas and I absolutely love it. I have it bookmarked, which is some things I wanted to share with you all today, but I just kind of wanted to read an expert of it to kind of give you an idea of what this video will be focused on because we are gonna talk about 10 tangible ways you can make your home more cozy, but it really is so much more than tangible items you add to your home. It really is kind of creating this happy place and warm place and welcoming place where you can really feel at home and other people who come to your home can also feel at ease and at rest and rejuvenated. So let me read this little introduction to what Huga really is. So Huga has been called everything from the art of creating intimacy, coziness of the soul, the absence of annoyance, to taking pleasure from the presence of soothing things, and my personal favorite, cocoa by candlelight. Coco by candlelight, like that's so magical. So Huga is about an atmosphere and an experience rather than about things. It is about being with the people we love, a feeling of home. A feeling that we are safe, that we are shielded from the world, and allow ourselves to let our guard down. You may be having an endless conversation about the small or big things in life, or just be comfortable in each other's silent company, or simply just by yourself enjoying a cup of tea. I just adore that so, so much. If you follow my channel for a while, you know how important home is to me and just establishing a cozy space, and I really want everyone who comes into my space and really who encounters me to feel happier and cozy inside. That's why I'm so in love with that word. And I also am so in love with this whole idea of the Huga culture and just creating that sort of space. So I'm really excited to share these tips and ideas with you all today. And I really hope you enjoy. So I made some notes. So if I glance down, that is what I'm looking at. And like I said, I will be sharing 10 different cozy hacks, if you will, but I split them into three different categories because some of them do kind of relate to each other, but they are their separate entities at the same time. So the three categories are light, textiles, and life. So for light, some really easy, easy, super simple things you can add to your home to make it more cozy are candles. I feel like this is a no brainer. If you love candles as much as I do, you know they instantly add an element of soft, romantic light that is just calming and soothing. And if you buy scented ones as well, it can also make the room smell better, but even unscented candles are so powerful and can really romanticize and cozy up a space so easily. I have candles sprinkled all around our little apartment. I have them in the bathroom, our bedroom, the living room, the kitchen. They really are everywhere and I am constantly lighting them. Make sure you are safe with them though. Make sure you blow them out after you're done but kind of once you get in the habit of lighting candles I feel like you get better about making sure you blow them out at the end of the night but this is such an easy and simple way to achieve this Huga space and then the next one are lamps so when you turn on your ceiling lights and just kind of the lights that are standard in homes and apartments, these are just so bright and they tend to be quite harsh. So I think it is so important and such a simple way to add in some softer light with lamps and you can also sprinkle these throughout your home. I have most of our lamps in our living room but also in our bedroom. Also while we're talking about lamps, I also want to talk about light bulbs because there are a ton of different light bulbs. If you go down the light bulb aisle at hardware store, there seriously are hundreds of different light bulbs and lots of them have different tones to them. So some have cooler tones and some have warmer tones. And personally, I'm 100% for the more warmer toned, yellow toned light bulbs. So make sure you get those warm colored light bulbs for your lamps. Okay, the next one is not the most obtainable one. This is the most tricky way to add coziness to your space and that is with a fireplace. So if you didn't know, I live in Florida 
and fireplaces are very rare here unless it is an older house and achieving this huga element is difficult for us floridians because like i said it's just we live in a hot climate like an air conditioner is what we need not a fireplace but again those older houses have them because back in the olden days we didn't have heaters or anything like that so it was necessary but nowadays it's just kind of a thing of the past but we do have these wonderful faux fireplaces that you can get at a variety of different stores and fire just adds such an element of huga and coziness i mean even just the crackling sound that comes from a real fireplace can be very soothing to most people and just the element of natural wood is also incredibly cozy so with the faux fireplaces you do kind of fall short except mine actually it does give off heat so it is a heater so it does serve another purpose besides just kind of creating that huga element to my space but i do think this is a good solve i would be remiss if i didn't share how cozy adding a fireplace is to your space even though it's not an actual real fireplace it does provide the feeling of the real deal okay now we're moving on to our next grouping of tips and that is textiles so we started with light and now we're moving to textiles and some simple ways that you can really add coziness is with throw blankets so i have a throw blanket basket behind me i have it draped on my couch i have it over my bed having blankets is Crucial. especially if you have guests coming over you want to make sure everyone has a blanket they can grab if they're cold when you want when you have people come over you want to make sure they are warm and feel at home and blankets are such a great way to do that and then the next textile that you can add to cozy up are rugs so I love rugs I even have a rug on my carpet in our apartment and I also stuck the rugs of course wherever we have you know laminate or tile like in the bathroom and in the kitchen and this helps collect dust but also it helps you to cozy up those cooler flooring spaces and add varying different textures all throughout your home okay the next one is one of my favorite ones because as humans, we do spend a lot of time sleeping and I think creating a haven and cloud of a bed is so incredibly important. We all work so hard in our jobs and life is tiring, so having a bed that you just are so excited to crawl in at the end of the night is so crucial. And I'm so excited to be partnering with Buffy to share their story and share their incredible products. So if you haven't heard of Buffy before, they offer everything from comforters to pillows to sheets and all of these products really come together to turn your bed to a comfy cozy oasis. I personally have the cloud comforter and there could not be a more perfect name for that comforter because it truly feels like a cloud and Buffy's products are made from ultra smooth eucalyptus fiber that feels softer than cotton making them breathable and cool to the touch to help maintain the ideal sleeping temperature and feel cozy without overheating so like I said, I am a Florida girl and although I do get chilly in the winter, I even have a heated blanket. I do also get really warm at night as well, especially in the summer months. But Buffy is so perfect because due to the eucalyptus fiber, it does help be more breathable and you don't get all stuffy. And the best thing about eucalyptus fiber is that it isn't just softer, but it's also more earth friendly and it's sourced from renewable forests and consumes 10 times less water to grow. And on top of that, it's transformed into ultra smooth fiber through a waste free production process. Buffy really cares about our earth and environment and the proof is in the pudding. All of their products, including comforters, pillows, and sheets are also cruelty free, hypoallergenic, no down feathers or animal products. But if you don't trust me, even though I am the queen of coziness, self-proclaimed, but still, I would like to think I'm the queen of coziness. Buffy and their products have over 17,000 five-star reviews, plus an overall average rating of 4.5 stars. So there you go. So if you'd like to try Buffy and their product in your own bed for free, before you commit to buying, you can. They have a free trial, free shipping, and free returns every day. 
So all you have to do is click the link in my description box and enter the promo code Allison and you'll get $20 off your Buffy bedding. So again, creating a really comfy bed situation is so crucial to creating an overall cozy home. And that goes the same for like guest rooms because of course if you ever welcome guests in your home, you wanna make sure that they feel as comfy and cozy as you do as well. Okay, our next little category is life. So we had light and then textiles and now we're on to life. And like I read at the beginning, Hugo really is focused on togetherness because really, you know, just the feeling of being with your family and friends provides a element of coziness that no tangible item could ever. So really creating a space that fosters that community and togetherness is so crucial to cozy and Huga home. So the first little way that you can add some life to your space is with plants. So adding this element of nature can just bring so much color and energy. I know that sounds kind of silly, but you know what I mean. Just having a plant that is growing and alive, even if it is a faux plant, that's still fine. It still adds that element of nature that is just so beautiful and inspiring. And I adore my plants and they really liven up our space so much. The next one, is board games. So in my book, they even talk about board games as well. And board games have just been such a incredible way to make friends as an adult. So we love to have game nights with our friends and it really just creates so much laughter and conversation, especially when you are making new friends. It's such a great way to bond. So we keep our games in our fireplace, which is so fitting, but really having that thing to do where you're not just like looking at a screen, staring at a phone, watching movies are great. I love watching movies, but when you're playing a game with people, you really can get so much closer. Okay, two more elements. The next one is another one of my favorites, and that is food. What is more cozy than fresh baked goods? And this is really igniting your senses because the smell of fresh baked cookies, fresh baked muffins is just everything and that lingering scent can make others feel warm and excited. Having just like fresh baked banana chocolate chip muffins every morning when I wake up that I can enjoy with my coffee is such a happy thing. And chocolate chip banana muffins are easily one of my favorite things to bake. And I like to just put them out on display on a cute little tray, especially if I have guests over. Having food is just crucial to being a cozy hostess. Okay, last one is something warm to drink. So again, I do live in Florida, so having something cold to drink can actually be preferred for most people, but I think it's great to have both. And having your hands wrapped around a cozy mug with something warm and steamy inside of it is one of my favorite feelings in the whole entire world. And I also have this jar where I keep different tea bags with different flavors. So when I have guests over, I love to offer them some cozy tea. I hope these cozy and Huga tips really inspired you to spend time making your space a happy place for you and others. It really does take a little bit of energy and work to foster that kind of space, but it's so incredibly worth it because I truly believe it creates an overall healthier and happy lifestyle. And I just want you guys to feel cozy as well because clearly it makes me happy and I just want you all to be happy too. So thank you for watching. I cannot wait to see you soon. Stay cozy. <laughs> Bye.